champions. We got a brand new character to preview. This time it is Charlotte Flair, Icons of WrestleMania. So if we have, well, before we check the moveset, let's look at the card. Reanimating a rivalry with Sasha Banks and Becky Lynch, both women went on to compete in two matches to determine, determine the uh, number one contender for Charlotte's WWE Divas Championship at WrestleMania 32, a triple threat match between Banks, Lynch, and Charlotte for the Divas Championship that was announced. At the event, after it was announced during the transmission that the Divas Championship would be withdrawn and it would be replaced with the new Women's Championship, with all three women competing for it in a triple threat match in which Charlotte defeated Lynch and Banks with help of her father to become the inaugural champion in her WrestleMania in-ring debut. So she's an acrobat. We're going to have a look at five-star bronze. The promoter bonus at 15k is showboat only. Earn 20% more war score from Faction Feud Battle. Links with the other icons and no gear bonus. First move set we'll have a look at is the Moonsault. 10 MP blue move. Finisher deals 65.6k damage and choose 9 red gems to destroy. The Spear, 5 MP red move. Deal 60.3k damage and choose one gem to make into three turn juggernaut gem that will increase your blue MP by three on every countdown turn and make all red gems into multiply gems of strain five at the end of the countdown. And the figure eight, six MP red move, submission place four sub gems and do 9400 damage for four turns while submission gems are on the gem board remaining sub gems turn into multiply gem of strength five now trainers we're going to use sting to start with four more reds we're going to use mats so that all those multiplies are going to be strength seven instead of strength five we're going to use otis so that the blue moves will deal 10 percent extra damage I don't really care much about creating the extra 10th red because it's pretty low chance that we're going to have 10 reds to begin with. And Undertaker, don't care about the extra multiply gem he would make because he's not. But I do care about the extra 5% that all those are going to do. So, let's see how it goes in action. We're going to go versus All of Fame Lena because it's really, really hard to find a good target on the road for five star female they all have restrictions so that's the best i can find she, we're not gonna have class advantage and uh, she's gonna be preventing 41 percent of my gem damage and 18 percent of my moves nothing i can do about that so keep that in mind got the basic buffs here let's do this Right. Let's put our juggernaut gem there. Now let's do the submission. Actually, let's put them on reds. At least I dodged. Uh, I believe it was ready again. Did the 150k? Let's put another one out. So mission. Let's 
Normally a computer is too dumb to go for it, but clearly he didn't this time. Not in a hurry to break it, because that way I'm getting some blue. <laughs> I'm not going to use my blue right away, because it's kind of a waste if I do at this point. Now she's got three moves ready, so we're going to use or submission. with a sub that took a while that worked well not as well as I thought it would though all right oh she does block half of my gem damage so it definitely hurts all right let's have a look at something else all right second move set for Charlotte Gonna be the natural selection, 6 MP blue move, deal 42.1k damage and swap a 3x2 random Maria into green gems. The knife edge chop, 6 MP green move, deal 44.6k damage and increase your blue gem damage by 54% for 2 turns, does not affect bonus damage. One arm sit out power bomb, 6 MP green move, deal 40k damage and choose 5 gems to make into blue gems. Our trainers will use for that Jerry Lawler to start with the blue. You could use also Steel, uh, George Steel, that would work as well. Uh, using NXT set to generate more blue. All of Fame Sting to generate more blue and have the blue do 5% more damage. And Elgin to generate one more blue. So we're going to be making a choose 11 blue with extra damage. Let's do this versus Lita again. Right, so let's make some green. Unfortunately, got rid of uh, a lot of blues. We're gonna increase blue damage. And now we're gonna make 11 blue.
And two more. She soaked up a lot of damage with that 41%. <laughs> and so it's ready again, so we're going to use it again. Fifty-four left. He kicked out, and my green is ready again. I'm gonna use it still. The hell just happened? I got a cat that just made a mess. We'll go clean that after this. She's done. One, two, three. All right, let's go clean that mess, and then we'll uh, we'll check that last uh, move set. All right, last move set is going to be a five-star version of the last one we saw. Basically, we're going to replace the move that increased our blue damage by the big boot, which is a three MP blue move deal, hundred and fifty-eight thousand damage. Now the trainers are going to be changing. We're still going to use Lawler to begin with that. In this case, I'd say it's much better to go with Lawler than George Till for sure. Sami Zayn, so that our blue gem uh, or blue move do 45% more damage. Otis, so that the blue move do 10% more damage. And Onky Tong Man Hall of Fame, so that blue move do an extra 20%. So it's overall going to be doing an extra 75%. And instead of being 157k, it's going to be 276k. So it's a pretty sizable upgrade. Let's do this. Now keep in mind she's blocking 18% of that. So we'll do the move damage. Just that already did a third of her health. Now we're gonna get some greens. Unfortunately, that ended our turn. damage not much left let's hope this doesn't end our turn it did but it ended her as well <laughs> that turned out okay I'm liking this one Alright, so that's pretty much it for Charlotte, guys. Thanks for watching. If you're not already a sub, make sure to do so to be kept aware when I post new stuff. Have any questions, ask them. And if you like the video, leave a like and share. See you guys. G up. Ciao.